What I've got here is a Craftsman uh, clamp-on amp meter, volt meter, continuity tester, uh, model 82369. And uh, I've had a problem with this thing ever since I got it, um, in that uh, the clamp-on amp meter wouldn't really work. In fact, it would read over limit for everything except the 400 amp range, which is kind of strange. Uh, every once in a while, it would just pop on and start working all of a sudden out of nowhere. Um, and I, I've taken it apart before and checked all the contacts and everything. And everything looked okay. Um, and I just went to go use it as a clamp-on amp meter again today, and it wasn't working. And I got really frustrated with it. Uh, so I was looking on YouTube trying to figure out if anyone else had the same problem. Uh, so what I did is I went ahead and opened it back up. Let's see if I can... to see if I could fix it again. And I took it all apart, made sure, uh, you know, this was all solid, everything looks good in there. And uh, what you've got is this little ribbon cable coming down from the ferrite in the, the clamp-on meter there. And then uh, right next to where that comes in, you see a little adjustment pot there? Just a tiny little adjustment pot. And, uh, you know, I was, I was at my wit's end. I was willing to uh, mess with its adjustment just to get it to work again. I uh, took a tiny little screwdriver in there. I just barely turned it one way and then back. Um, just barely touched it. And lo and behold, it started working again. Um, so my theory here is that uh, this pot kind of got some corrosion, something in it, and uh, kept it from making contact. So all I did is did like a little, uh, I barely even moved it and it started working again. And I put it right back to where it was. Uh, it was pointing straight up and down this way. And uh, that's about as, as good as I can get it. Uh, I don't have a, you know, a, a regulated power supply to actually test its uh, output to a reference source. Um, but I'm on AC mode. Uh, in the 40 amp range, and uh, I'm getting 0 0.02. Um, that's about normal for an AC clamp on meter. Um, so I'm good. I put it right back to about where it was, and uh, I started working again. So if you're having a problem with your clamp meter and it's not reading anything, uh, give that little thing a, a micro adjustment. It might just have some corrosion in there, keeping it from making contact. Uh, now I can go get my job done. All right, here we are outside, uh, measuring my amperage on uh, various electrical loads to see uh, where our biggest draws are. And uh, you can see there, it's uh, reading uh, almost 16 amps there. That's for our jacuzzi spa there. And that's one of our biggest draws right there. Uh, the other one is our, our well. Well's actually pulling 10 amps. Uh, it seems a little high to me. I'll have to check that out. But as you can see, the Craftsman amp meter works really well. That there is the uh, air conditioner, which obviously is not on. Well, not obviously. It's uh, <laughs> it's the winter time. We're not using our AC, and it's reading 0 .02. Um, everything else I checked was right on as well. Uh, come up here to. Total usage on the main line there. Looking at 31 amps on that leg. And 13.92 on that leg. And let's see if we got anything going to ground there. Get it on there, set you down there. And that's ground. That's a good thing. You don't want to see all kinds of amps going to ground. So it's working good.